Well, one is attending Harvard, the other is just heading into middle school. But as I found out, this San Diego brother and sister are positively on the same track when it comes to the game of chess and their desire to share it with others. In this story, that is positively San Diego. We set up the tables and everything and we're like, oh no, that's not, a, that's not enough boards for like, we thought it would be fine. And then more and more people would come in. Like way too many people. <laughs> Luke and Mila Seperak are talking about the chess club at the San Carlos Library. The two of them voluntarily work to revitalize Luke running the program. Just kind of managing people, uh, moving people around, who gets to play against who. And Mila recruiting new players. I was the one who spread it around my school and convinced some of my uh, classmates to come over to the chess club. The two learn the game from their parents and enjoy sharing their skills, even creating online videos when the pandemic put a hold on in-person play. It opens up a lane for the bishop to travel across the board and put the king in checkmate. Chess has seen a burst in interest since last year's Netflix series, The Queen's Gambit, with millions more now playing the game online. But Luke and Mila are ultimately focused on promoting a game that's face-to-face. -face. What was it that inspired you to say, no, I want this to be more of a social activity at the library? Like the online format, it's good, but it feels, it always felt to me more like that kind of other sports, head at wall, like you don't know the other person like you can't see them, um, it tends to feel kind of disconnected. Whereas in person, it's just a matter of, hey, hi, how are you? Let's play a game of chess. Luke says playing together also makes the game easier to teach and learn. Excelling, just a matter of practice. Like some sports where you're limited by just, are you tall? Are you fast enough? Are you, can you become strong enough? It's something where anybody can just play with other people and just get better, like exponentially. With Luke spending more time away at college, Mia plans to pick up the reins, keeping chess going at the San Carlos Library just as soon as it is deemed COVID safe. And she's confident there will be plenty of players ready to take part. Chess is very popular in my school now. <laughs> like the kids at my school, they love it. Five to seven every second and fourth Tuesday of the month at the San Carlos Public Library. <laughs> That is when it's deemed safe to do so again. Now, Luke says when applying to colleges, recruiters, including those at Harvard, where he was ultimately accepted, uh, noted that they were very impressed by his volunteerism related to chess. And we would like to share your Positively San Diego stories. If you have uh, one you'd like to send us, well, send us an email. Let us know about it. Tips at 10news.com.